Welcome back. The Supreme Court has sent a notice to Formula One organizers JP Group and Uttar Pradesh government over the exemption of entertainment tax in the upcoming Formula One race at the Buddh International Circuit. The Supreme Court notice came on a public interest litigation challenging luxury tax exemption on Formula One race. What we are saying is this is an elite sport where corporate houses are vying with each other to pay one crore for a box where tickets are going for as high as 35,000. Now, does this kind of a event uh, justify exemption for entertainment tax or luxury tax? Our answer is no. Secondly, the, the uh, policy also was suited to benefit the organizers in such a way that, that the organizers were directed to be given exemption in a matter of two days by the state, uh, state of UP a direction was given to the commissioner to give this exemption. So everything was pre-planned and premeditated to help the organizers. Too many cooks spoil the broth, a popular saying that has had many stay away from indulging too much in any good thing. But one chef from the city is taking it all in, especially since he has just launched his very own website that reads just as well as his reputed culinary skills in the kitchen. Chef Jukesh Arora of the Rain Tree is soaking in the moment and Kali Sai got to spend some time with the chef outside the busy confines of the kitchen. ChefArora.com is no ordinary website. It has set an example for all professional chefs on the stepping stones to entrepreneurship. As famous chef Jagesh Arora launched his own website, the word was loud and clear. A chef's life is much more than just grinding spices in the confines of his kitchen. The website not only provides helpful guidelines about food safety measures and tips on how to open your own restaurant, it also enlists India's top chefs and their famous preparations. That's not all. If you're a hotel management student and are searching for the right door to open, you can post your resume right here on this website and get a chance to work with the best. The running hotel can take advice and they can change their menus, they can look for good staff, they can look for the other things, standard operating procedures, the food safety management system which is lacking in India too much. Not only the five-star hotels, even the other smaller hotels in India, unfortunately, the food service management, the food uh, uh, service management means the food um, safety management, I mean to say, is, is not uh, up to the mark. So here where the chefrora.com can play a very important role that people can understand the importance of food safety, that is the hygiene part of the food where the people don't get ill. The chef's initiative was lapped up by one and all. From colleagues who fondly remembered Chef Arora's humble journey that began in a sweet shop in Mumbai to corporates who lauded this innovative venture. Chef Arora has been uh, in this uh, line for quite some time and uh, he's been very successful and he is wanting to start something on his own and uh, uh, start a consultancy which is very much needed. Chef Arora has a reputation for constantly experimenting with and evolving both his cuisines and business models. If that is anything to go by, we just have to wait and see how many more flavors are added to this website. In Chennai with Kali Sayak, Natasha Dureswami for NDTV Hindu. It does seem like a yummy idea indeed. That's all we have on headlines now. More updates will follow at 9.